Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you, real quick, how to permanently delete files instead of using the Recycle Bin. In other words, when you click Delete, the file will not go into the Recycle Bin. As you can see, my Recycle Bin is empty to show you. Instead, the file will just be deleted. You won't have to delete it from the Recycle Bin later. There's two ways to do this for everything or on a per file basis. I like the per file basis. Once you know that, I think you'll prefer it, but let's show you how to do it. Let's right click on the recycle bin and hit properties. Make sure you've highlighted the drive. You may have a couple of drives. You can see like on my main computer, I have two drives. So make sure you highlight the correct drive and just check this box right here next to don't move files to the recycle bin. While you're here, you might consider the display delete confirmation dialog. I'll show you that in a second. It's when you press delete and it says, are you sure you want to delete the file? You can actually do away with that as well. All right. So step two, here is a test file, simple text document. If you press down shift with that file highlighted and then press delete or press shift and right click and press delete, there's a recycle bin prompt that we just discussed. Once I click yes, you won't see anything here in Recycle Bin. It will be deleted. There you go. So that's kind of my favorite way because that allows you to still use a Recycle Bin, but if you want to delete something, you don't want to waste space in your Recycle Bin, that's all you got to do is hit delete. Now, I'm going to let you out of here, but before we go, obviously we just showed you how to enable or disable the recycle bin delete confirmation box but there's some other cool stuff down here at the bottom just look for the link up here to get to this tutorial and follow through how to change the storage size how to empty it when you're shutting down your computer which is another pretty cool option and how to automatically empty the recycle bin as you want to do it it's pretty neat so there you have it how to permanently delete files instead of using the recycle bin have fun see ya